Hey guys, I'm Kaya, and I don't know about you, but I love deep fried foods. If you've ever felt intimidated by deep frying before, then stick around because this is your two minute deep frying guide. Let's get started by looking at what you will need. A cast iron pot, six to 10 cups of a neutral oil with a high smoke point, a slotted spoon or spider for scooping, a wire rack for cooling and keeping your goods crispy. Most importantly, a thermometer. I use infrared, you could also use a candy or frying thermometer. And last but not least, of course, something to fry, in our case, some chicken legs. Fill your pot up about halfway with your neutral oil and bring it up to temperature over medium high heat. If the oil is too cold when your food goes in, the food will absorb the oil and become greasy. If it's too hot, the oil will start to smoke and get a really funky flavor. Ideally, you want it to be around 325 to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, depending on what your recipe requires. Once your oil is up to temperature, use your spoon or your spider to carefully add your goods to the hot oil. And remember not to crowd your pot. Adding too much to the pot at once can cause the temperature of the oil to drastically decrease. Fry until golden and crispy, then scoop and transfer to your wire rack for cooling. More delicate fried items like tempura are best eaten right away, but heartier items like fried chicken or falafel, you can keep in a 275 degree oven for up to 30 minutes. But I think I'll just eat mine right away. Mm, so good. I hope this quick look at deep frying helps you feel empowered to try making your own favorite fried foods. Thank you so much for watching.